What's going on, everybody? Brian Magliu on live at the 2019 TW Volleyball Media Day. I'm joined alongside head coach Jeff Hebner. Coach, thank you so much for taking some time and chatting with us. First off, what are your thoughts on Media Day? Always a fun time this time of year. What are your thoughts so far? Yeah, this is one of our favorite times. I mean, the excitement is obviously high. For us, Media Day is a time to express yourself and then, you know, kind of put yourself in a good light uh, as we move forward in the, in the year. And our kids really take it pretty seriously, and they have some good competitions like class pictures and individual photos, and the GIFs have been fun this year, so or GIFs, if you would. So we're good to go. And you mentioned the personalities on this team. Mm -hmm. We kind of got a glimpse of that from the Pioneer postcards that we saw last week, your team taking a trip to Costa Rica. Mm -hmm. Talk a little bit about that trip and uh, just some of the highlights that you experienced on that journey. Man, talking about highlights is hard because it's hard to eliminate things. Um, you know, I was talking to Trixie Oche, and she was telling me that um, of her five most incredible life experiences, they all happened on that trip. And so for us, you know, we got a chance to really uh, mesh as a team and kind of go through the process of where we learn a little bit about, you know, how do we form into this year's group versus last year's group um, and add the three new players in. But um, our, our athletes are just incredible people. And so the character was really fun to see as we traveled because um, the way that they bonded was just very natural and very easy. And that's a testament to our returners for sure. You mentioned the meshing of the new players with the returning players. How key was that trip in getting your team ready for this upcoming where there's a lot of change in the Lone Star Conference? Mm -hmm. How does that help your team and what are your expectations moving forward as the year goes on? Yeah, I mean, you know, for us, we got 10 days or 12 days that other other schools didn't get, which I think is a huge win. Um, but really, it was less about, you know, the competitive advantage and more for the, the life experience. And, you know, this is this was and will continue to be one of my favorite moments as a coach. And so, um, you know, with the new student athletes that got to come in, Tabitha had a little bit of a head start. She joined us in the spring. Um, but the two new freshmen that came in, you know, they got a chance to really experience CW volleyball in a really unique way as freshmen and then be able to set the standard for the groups to follow. Um, you know, with 20, almost 20 teams in the Lone Star this year, we are looking forward to the, the different faces and kind of the new travel partners. For us, it's a little bit different because on our side, we only added Arkansas Fort Smith and um, UT Tyler to our pod. And so we have a lot of the same familiar faces. Um, but our travel is a lot nicer, and our experience, I think, will be a little bit better for the student part of the student-athlete, which obviously we're all really excited about. Um, and then this year is the group. I mean, they've been up with us since we were hired, and you know, we owe a lot of our success to these six seniors. And who they are as people is something that you know, drives me to come to work every day and grind it out and you know, work to create a commitment to excellence that um, permeates our whole institution. So we're excited to represent TWU, and we appreciate being – um, you know, kind of the first team out of the gate there, which is really fun for us. Well, Coach, thank you so much for spending some time with us. For more on your TWU volleyball, be sure to check out TWUathletics.com.